sanctuary. Hello, YouTubers, and all those who happen to watch. I got another early birthday present. This has been a good year so far. Keep up the good work, everybody. Um, all right, so I got here is a the mystical ninja Goman. And I'm guessing everyone underneath the sun basically heard about uh, Mystical Ninja or Goman if they're uh, SNES fans or NES fans at least. Well, at least SNES fans because, you know, N64 as well. You know, my brother gave this to me for an early birthday present on top of something else, which I'll show you guys after because it would be sort of like a little um, thing. I'm going to have to do a tutorial video and a oh, how-to video if you will, for it. But I'm going to show you some gameplay of this right now. Uh, before I do that, though, I'm going to show you quickly what the carts look like in Japan. Of course, if you guys don't know what the heck a Famicom cart looks like by now, it looks like something came out of the uh, Sega Genesis library. Oddly enough, there's a hole there, which I'm guessing you put keychains there to identify which game is what, if you were to slide it in or like that. Or if it's your favorite game, I guess, you can... Uh, I don't really freaking know, honestly. The only thing I know is you put, like, ball chains in there, and... Yeah. Basically, this is the car. Um, I'm gonna be able to show you guys how to... You know, what you guys can do if you get, like, a converter inside one of your games. And I'll show you after. You'll you'll be, like... You'll be left in horror and amazement at the same time when I do this. But I have to do it when I get the, uh... Cart, so that way it makes sense. But I'm not. It's not going to be a very long video. Again, I like to thank my brother though for the present. Um, I'm also going to show you the game. This is a translated version right now. This is going to be an emulated copy because obviously you know I can't. <laughs> what the hell? Anyway, best I can do. And why the heck is it like that? Oh well. This is again. Decent game. It has mixed up elements of, you know, fighting and uh, Zelda style. Why the heck is this game... Okie dokie. Let's try that again. I mean, the sprites are pretty awkward. You're like, what the heck? But, you know, once you get into the dab into the game play... Why the heck? Huh. Uh, technical difficulties, the ROM doesn't work. So that's why, of course, you'd w really want to stick to the carts of these. So, um, all right, let's go back to the drawing board. Okay. I'll grab another copy and swap it out with, get rid of this one. And swap it. Um, <laughs> put that into action. What version is this? Ah, drop it into that. Okay, let's try this again. Okie dokie. Make sure everything's angled perfectly. There we go. Again, the quality is going to be crappy on this uh, quick cam. Just really showing you off what the game looks like. So you guys have a general assessment and how this game plays. Um, I think I believe I, I would tell right off the bat anyone who's a Jap who's from Japan or know of games from Japan um, would know of this game or the series somewhat. It's media. It's one of the. It's the top. It was like a pretty good seller back in the day. I mean, it was sort of like an under an under cheek and bone kind of thing, if you actually know about it. Some of these guys are samurais. A hot girl. You like rescue her, you get some money. Okay, there's no money coming out of this. Oh, there we go. You dispense gold, which... I kind of don't like that. It makes me nervous. Okay. Alright, so you jump over him. Remember that when you guys want to try this game out. 
jump over the ooh hot girl hope those girls aren't young because I don't want to go in jail for that this game so far is pretty good I mean I can't wait to play this in the actual cart like lay down on my bed and just chill and play this I got the uh, control deck nest so you know this yeah thank you for yelling mom um, YouTube is appreciative of that anyway 85 cash let's see what we can afford here our regato okay whatever the heck that is purchased it though hmm I wonder ha 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 oh oh that hurt basically free stuff there but yeah this is on a timer so I better get going I'm running pretty freaking fast too holy crap it's like an acid I'm jumping far too wow Oh, hot chick. Rescue her. Okay. I don't know what the heck that means, but whatever. Um, oh, crap. Go on. 100 from him. Rescue her. Go down the stairs. Shoot. Uh, I can see that plays like that. All right, you could basically hop over everything like Chuck Norris in this mode. Get the scroll that absolutely has no significant any reason of being there. But yeah, um, I'm gonna play some more of this game on the emulator. But um, you guys can check this out for yourself. It's called Gomon, or I'll give you a better description, or I'll give you a better cover. Made sure I had this up beforehand. Ganbri or Gambra. Golmon. If you want to try out the game, I suggest trying it. You know, if you like it from the gameplay you saw and you, you know, played the game yourself, um, I suggest buying it for the Famicom. You know, it's not that bad. It's pretty darn decent for uh, what it is. You know, if, seeing as I'm going to have the Japanese copy and have no freaking clue what the hell to do, I'm probably going to have to do what my brother does and look side by side to look at the screen, look at the, <laughs> to uh, figure out what's what in the game. But. You know, that was basically it from my neck of the woods. Um, if you guys have any Famicom games, aside from Luke, because I know Luke's basically going to be like, do I? <laughs> oh boy, he would put me to shame. I only have one Famicom game. <laughs> thanks to my brother. But again, thanks again, Sean, for the game. And when the surprise comes in the mail, then uh, I'll show you guys some uh, stuff. Take it easy.